Hello and welcome to this Map Pro screencast. Today I'm going to be talking about connecting to your data with SQL Pro. I'm going to be using Mac OS 10 Yosemite and Map Pro 3.073. Okay, so this is really easy to do. Um, in Map 3, there's a few native options here. In addition to PHP MyAdmin, one is SQL Pro. Uh, depending on what version of Map Pro you have, this may already be installed or when you click on it, you have to download the application. Uh, when you do download the application, it's going to be located in your applications map uh, folder. So here's my SQL Pro app. Okay, so uh, to connect, all you have to do is open up uh, SQL Pro. Um, what you want to do it depends on um, what version you downloaded. Yours might look a little different, but I'm going to go here to File uh, and um, Add New Connection tab. And uh, what you want to do is just go to Socket. And um, all you have to do here is fill out your uh, username that we gave you, uh, which is root. And there's your default password, which you probably should change, is also root. And that's all you have to do to connect. Um, I'll test the connection first. Connection succeeded. And if I do connect, I will see my data over here. Uh, these are some tables I have, my cool data. And uh, there's a lot you can do with uh, SQL Pro, you'll have to uh, check out the SQL Pro website or the uh, help pages to see what you can do with that. Um, a few things. Um, SQL Pro seems to know where the um, socket file, this is from the website, sqlpro.com, um, seems to know where the socket file is. Um, it's applications map temp, mysql, mysql. Uh, dot sock, but if you are asked to point to the socket file, um, uh, this is where it's going to be, and uh, so they, they, uh, the application seems to already know that. Um, if um, you do one, and one last thing, if you do look on your finder, I am pointing to that directory, and I even have hidden files. Uh, I can see hidden files and I don't see it and I don't know why, but I know if you go to your, here in my um, terminal window, I can see it. I can even, um, this is my uh, applications map temp, my SQL folder, that same folder I was looking in the finder, and I see a mysql.soc. So when you're, um, MySQL is running, this file should be there. So if you do have to um, find that file or point to it to connect to your database, you know where it is. And that's going to conclude this screencast for connecting to your data with SQL Pro.